think people get stuck with branding and are unable to take it to that next level, to that branding brilliantly level? I think they just get, um, well, first of all, we are so constrained by what we think is right, wrong, good, bad. And in reality, that doesn't really exist. There is no right, wrong, good, bad. It's what works and what doesn't work, right? In terms of when you're looking at the world. But a lot of times we, we have been taught since we were children really to fit in, to really not rock the boat, to be, well, women and men have been taught two different things, actually. Men have been taught to be manly, you know, which means to speak their mind and be more aggressive, go after what they want, things like that. Women have been taught to be more demure and not, um, you know, rock the boat. It's kind of the two opposites, right? So when you're coming and looking at the brand, it's like, well, I can't do that. Or people in my field, I, I work sometimes with, uh, I've worked with a lot of um, PhD psychologists and therapists. And they're like, well, we don't do that. In our profession, we don't do that. And I'm like, that's exactly why you need to do it. <laughs> you, know, you need to do something that's different than what the herd is doing. You know, I think um, it's like you need to purple cow your business, essentially. You've got to learn what are the things that really make you who you are so that you can bring it to your business and feel completely confident in what it is you're doing. 